in my last video I was explaining uh, I had forgotten that uh, I didn't explain the 45 degree I thought I had explained I'd only explained 30 and 60 okay so this is where we finished we proved that sine 30 is half so I'll show you so sine 30 you know this is in the previous page so sine 30 where is sine 30 yeah, sine 30 is half then we see that cos 60 is also half they're complementary 30 and 60 are complementary okay now when you talk about sine 60 that's root 3 over 2 cos 30 would also be root 3 over 2 then we saw tan 30 is 1 over root 3 and tan 60 is root 3 and we made up a table and I told you how to remember sine 30 is root 1 over 2 uh, sine 45 is root 2 over 2 so let me explain this how let me delete this I told you that root 2 over 2 becomes 1 over root 2 so let me explain that so root 2 over 2 can be written as root 2 times 1 over 2 can be written as root 2 times root 2 root 2 times root 2 is root 4 okay so okay what do I mean so root 2 times root 2 dot means times is root 4 and root 4 is 2 so 2 can be written as root 2 times root 2 so this 2 and 2 this cancel so root 2 over 2 is 1 over root 2 that's what I'm saying okay so I'll explain this how 1 over root 2 you get okay so I've drawn a simple uh, uh, 45 degree right angle triangle so if two angles of a triangle are equal I can say that this side so this is triangle ABC okay this angle and this angle are equal so AB will be equal to AC so let me say if this is X this will also be X now using Pythagoras using Pythagoras or Pythagoras theorem can I say X squared plus X squared is equal to a squared so this is 2x squared is equal to a squared so now if you divide both sides by 2 x squared is x squared is a squared over 2 and now if you take square root of this side uh, if you take square root of this side let me make the square root bigger it will take the square root of this side so this becomes x is uh, a over root 2 okay so this a oh, sorry root 2 so this is a over root 2 and this is also a over root 2 so now 10 45 sorry sine 45 sine 45 is opposite over opposite over hypotenuse so this is a over root 2 divided by a over 1 so that becomes a over root 2 times 1 over a so this a and this a gets cancelled so sine 45 is 1 over root 2 that is same as 2 2 what did we say uh, root 2 over 2 okay 1 over root 2 is a bit difficult to remember like this but if you go from here this is this is root 3 over 2 this is root 2 over 2 this is root 1 over 2 sorry this is root 3 root 2 root 1 okay so that is root 2 over so this is same as root 2 over 2 same way cos 45 would be the same because for 45 you take adjacent or opposite they are the same so sine 45 and cos 45 are the same it is 1 over root 2 which is root 2 over 2 and tan 45 is opposite over adjacent so your opposite and adjacent are equal 
so you can say that is a over root 2 divided by a over root 2 and they are the same so that is 1 and that's why 1045 is 1 okay and uh, that's sign 1045 is 1 I already explained this too okay see you in the next one